Why are red pandas endangered? Welcome back to Shelby on Safari, the place where I, a wild animal biologist, answers your animal questions. So you ready? Join the safari and let's get started. To answer this question, there was one place to go, the IUCN Red List of Threatened Species. The IUCN Red List was established in 1964 and has certainly grown over the years. It's much more than just a list. It is a critical indicator of the health of the world's biodiversity and it is universally used by governments, nonprofits, researchers, and students. The processing of assessing a species, whether it's an animal or a plant, is rather intense and involves massive collaboration and cooperation between stakeholders. Currently, there are more than 150,000 species on the IUCN Red List, with more than 40 2,000 of them being threatened with extinction. Now, you may be familiar with some of the terms of the IUCN Red List, like endangered or near threatened, but there's also data deficient and not evaluated. But today we're going to explore why the IUCN Red List classifies the red panda as endangered. The red panda was last assessed by the IUCN Red List in 2015, and they met the criteria for the endangered category. This is because its population has declined by 50% over the last three generations, which scientists have calculated for the red panda is 18 years. This decline is expected to continue and may even get worse. Those involved with assessing the red panda's status have identified five key threats to the red panda. Firstly, as the diet of the red panda is about 98% bamboo, you can imagine that bamboo is rather important. The bamboo plants that they eat show massive flowering events followed by dying off, which isn't ideal as it leaves the pandas without any food, as it's quite hard to find new feeding grounds when their habitat is already quite fragmented. And if they do go on the hunt for new feeding grounds, new bamboo, they are exposed to other threats. And it's also a bit tricky because bamboo itself won't easily reestablish in areas where there's been environmental degradation and deforestation, which is happening where the red panda is. The the second key threat is canine distemper. I know that sounds a bit weird, but it is lethal to red pandas. Now with people coming more into contact with red pandas than they would have in the past, that also brings along dogs, both of the domestic and feral variety, which isn't good in terms of canine distemper, because unless all dogs, both domesticated and feral, are vaccinated against this disease, well, it's likely that the red panda population will suffer. Now, the third key threat to red pandas, and one of the reasons why they're considered endangered, is actually they're very super specific when it comes to house hunting. Very picky customer. They look for forest type, altitude, a gentle slope grade, Gradient, close to water, precipitation levels, even the presence of tree stumps. But they aren't the only ones who love the gentle slope. Herders with their dogs and cattle love it as well and often trample on the bamboo, which as we know is not ideal for the red panda's diet or for protecting them from the canine distemper. The fourth threat to red pandas is sadly in the form of hunting, both for their skin, meat, but also for the pet trade. And the last key threat facing red pandas is the increase of human Humans. In particular, when people move into the red panda's habitat, scientists have found that red panda mortality is high in these disturbed areas. However, while this video is very sad because of the nature of the question, there certainly is hope. The incredible folks over at the Red Panda Network are doing fantastic work to raise awareness and support local communities in preserving these incredible animals and their habitat. I encourage you to check out their website. I'll put a link to them down in the description below. They're also over on Instagram. Who doesn't love getting cute red panda pictures in their Instagram feed, am I right? To keep your adventure going, why not check out my video on red pandas just here? Go on, click it, I'll see you over there. Thanks so much for watching.